Hey, what's up everyone? I wanted to show you how to create a completion bar like this here in Google Sheets in its own cell. But I'm going to teach you in such a way that you can change this up to look however you prefer. In order to do this, we're just going to use this sample data I randomly created and create a new sheet so we can create this fresh. And we're going to write completion report and then in order to do this we're going to use the repeat character because we want to repeat a certain character so many times so we want to repeat the char which is character and we want to put in the dec number of the character we want in this case the open or i'm sorry the medium square with it that shaded in is 9632 and we want it to repeat 76 times, which we're referencing B2, so it's um, convertible all the way down the cells. So we want to repeat the shaded in box 76 times, and because it's a percentage, we want the remaining 24 to be empty. So in order to do that, we put an ampersand to show that we want to also put in another character, and we also want it to repeat. So we hit our repeat character, and 9633 happens to be the open character box. The number we want here is 100 less the 76, or cell B2. And we hit enter, and we'll autofill here. And we see we get 76 shaded in squares and 24 unshaded squares. Likewise here we get 95 shaded, 5 unshaded, and so on. But the reason why this is scalable to any sort of um, DEC character that you prefer is you can simply look up DEC characters of various shapes and change this number to match what you want it to look like. You can also make it more than just two characters or less than two characters by either removing this portion of the statement or adding more ampersands and adding more characters. Thanks a lot for watching.